State troopers and local law enforcement will be on high alert as Georgians hit the road during the Memorial Day weekend. Rihanna Richardson spoke with a traveler and with the Georgia State Patrol. She joins us live with more on what this holiday will look like. Yes, that's right. According to Georgia State Patrol, that holiday traffic will start to kick in about 6 p.m. tomorrow and it will run through Monday. Tiffany Biesterfeld, her husband and two kids are among those Central Georgians preparing to hit the road for the holiday. We are driving down to Lake Placid, Florida, and then we are headed to Fort Lauderdale, Florida for a week. And then after that, we go to the weekend in Marco Island, Florida. <laughs> and then my husband and I are flying for our anniversary to the Dominican Republic. When they return, they're driving home. She says it's a total of about 16 hours on the road. Yeah, we definitely watch the road because especially during this travel weekend, there are people that are out and about and drinking and driving and not driving safely. That's why Georgia State Patrol plans to keep an eye out. Lieutenant Maurice Rain says driving is a privilege, not a right. So take every step to be safe. We're going to be out in full force with local agencies across the state of Georgia enforcing the laws. We don't want people speeding. We want them to realize it's better to arrive late than to not to arrive at all. We want them to slow down. We also want them to understand that we're not going to tolerate impaired driving. The governor's office of highway safety wants everyone to buckle up before getting on the road and be sure to secure all children. They also encourage you to take breaks on long trips and even switch drivers if needed. According to the state patrol, 15 people were killed in traffic crashes during last year's Memorial holiday weekend. We, we want everybody to enjoy, but understand we all play a part. We need the public to do their part, and I can assure you we're going to do our part. He says you can also be pulled over if your car has a mechanical problem, like a broken taillight. Are you excited? Yeah. And Beesterfeld yeah. says her family can't wait. Yeah. Our children have been so desperate to get out and socialize and families to see each other and reunite. So I think just reconnecting, stay safe, you know, use the protection you need to do, use wise choices and just have a great time. And Reigns also says, don't forget Georgia's hands-free law, so put those phones down. Live in Macon, Brianna Richardson, 13 WMAZ News. Yeah, thank you, Brianna. AAA predicts a 60% increase in travelers nationwide for the holiday when compared to last Memorial Day. If you're planning to take a drive to Orlando, Myrtle Beach, or Nashville, be prepared. AAA says they are some of the top road destinations this year, so you may run into more people than normal in those places.